It's December 16, 2022, Friday afternoon, about uh, 1.30. And today uh, I'm over at Southwest Harbor. Uh, we're looking at some weather coming in, uh, basically starting today and uh, tonight and tomorrow. And uh, most of Maine is going to see this as a big winter storm. Uh, it's supposed to be mostly rain here out on Mount Desert Island. So anyway, I'm going to walk over to the other side of the truck and show you what Southwest Harbor looks like right now. Now right now I am at the uh, town dock on the south side of the harbor and the wind is coming in from the sort of east northeast. So it's going to be windy when I walk around the truck. As you can see it's pretty choppy here in the harbor. All white caps. And as the wind picks up, well as you can see it was pretty blowy out there. Uh, I am now in the truck shooting through the window. There's a little bit of mist uh, blowing onto the window. It's pretty rough out there in Southwest Harbor. And whenever we get these easterly storms, Southwest Harbor can get very rough. Particularly out here in the outer harbor. And over there, we're looking past Clark Point toward the entrance to Soam Sound. And it's uh, choppy out there, so let's move around and take a look at a few other places around here and some different views. Okay, I'm at the top of the boat ramp here at the Manset Town Dock, just uh, oh, 50 yards from where I was before, looking out across the harbor. Again, from in the truck because the uh, wind is blowing pretty hard out there. It's supposed to blow 30 to 45 miles an hour today. You can see it's pretty choppy here. Does have a bit of a north component. The swell does, which uh, out here it's pretty much unobstructed. You can see today would not be a good day uh, to launch your boat or haul it out at this ramp. There's some pretty good size uh, waves coming in here that would make it a little tricky to haul or launch your boat. <laughs> and uh, if you're out on a mooring, you would definitely be getting a bouncy ride right now. Now I have to say, this is not bad at all compared to some of the conditions we see here uh, during big storms. I have seen six foot waves in Southwest Harbor when it was blowing 50 knots out of the east and had been doing it for a while. And uh, on those days, uh, your boat can get a really rough ride. So what I'm gonna do now is we're gonna head up the harbor. Now because this uh, wind and the swell in particular has a bit of a north component, I'm expecting that it's gonna be a lot flatter as we head west uh, to the head of the harbor. Okay, I'm over at the Great Harbor Marina here in Southwest Harbor, Maine. And as you can see, the harbor is much calmer up here because there's a north component to the wind. So basically, here, as far as waves go, we're in the lee of Clark Point over there. And the breakwater that the marina put in a few years ago has a huge effect on how rough it is here right at the marina. There's another interesting thing here at the marina today, and that is, well, one, because of the weather, the lobster fishermen are all in for the day, but there are some other interesting boats here that have shown up just recently. Uh, you can see these uh, large boats out there, the one with the large reel on the back. That's a, a fishing boat rigged for uh, actual fishing for fish. But the one in front of it is a scallop dragger. And this black boat here is also rigged for scallop dragging. That's right, it's scallop season here in Maine. 
and uh, scallop draggers are headed out every day where the weather isn't horrible and uh, well and that the season is open it's not open every day so right now I think it's open about three to four days a week and you can go out and fish for scallops drag for them and they're quite a lucrative fishery but of course the scallop fishery here in Maine runs from uh, late November into about March so it is not a fair weather fishery so I just wanted to show you the difference that being in the lee of a point makes there's much less wind here and the harbor is much much flatter over there on the south side of the harbor which is over there it's a little rougher than here because it's not so much in the lee but uh, north side of the harbor over here you can see there are almost no white caps and it's not rough at all and in here in the marina because of the breakwater and the location it is also uh, quite sheltered and I don't know if you can see it let me get out here you can see that green boat coming in with the light oh get out of the wind <laughs> I had to move back a little bit more behind the truck because the wind picked up all of a sudden. But we've got another scallop dragger coming in. So they were uh, either out fishing today or they're coming down, probably from down East Maine, to fish in this area. And we're going to get a good look at that boat once it rounds the breakwater and heads into the marina. Okay, you can just see that scallop dragger coming in now. And uh, he's going to tie up over there on the southernmost dock, but on the inside of it. Yeah, I think he's going to turn around and uh, then come up against the dock. Now, most of these boats are also used for lobster fishing, so uh, these fishermen are very, very skilled at handling these single engine power boats that don't have bow thrusters or anything like that. And uh, that's about a 50 foot boat. You can see he's just uh, turning it around and not much over its own length. And he will uh, find a spot to tie up. And I think this particular dragger is a side dragger. Some of them are stern draggers. And he's got a little house at the back of the boat for uh, shucking the scallops. Yeah, I'm not sure what he's going to do. He's kind of, the view of him is kind of blocked by these other boats. He's deciding where he wants to go, I think. He's just kind of sitting there right now. Since the wind is going to be east, he probably wants to be facing east. There he goes. Yeah, I don't know. He may have decided there wasn't room. He'll find someplace else to tie up. There's a small gap over there, not much bigger than his boat. Now he's backing down. One advantage he's got is that the wind does have a north component. That is an east-west facing pier, so the wind will blow him onto it. But uh, yeah, there he goes, just backing into the gap between two other boats. And that's uh, how he'll dock.
and oh, there's his deck hand just got off the boat he's going to grab a stern line and tie the boat up back at the stern and then they'll uh, finish tying it off so there we go we have a scallop dragger coming in uh, who is apparently out today despite the weather he might have been fishing in a relatively short sheltered area but to get back into the great harbor here he certainly had to buck some weather anyway <laughs> get out of the wind here anyway i just wanted to show you a little bit of what it looks like here when there is a bit of rough weather here in the great harbor of mount desert island maine and it's going to get worse tonight it's supposed to get really choppy and we're probably going to see a lot of rain, maybe a little snow tonight, but uh, supposed to get about an inch of rain tomorrow, and that will certainly wash away whatever snow we get. But if you go inland 25 miles from here, probably see uh, almost all snow. So it's going to be a nasty storm here in Maine. But as usual, here on the southern part of Mount Desert Island, it's probably going to be uh, mostly rain, whereas even just a few miles inland, it's going to be all snow. Okay, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel.